Welcome back to this Viking Model 2000, an amazing Swedish made machine, born back in 1958. We have a lot of buyers ask about upholstery material type sewing. They're looking to do sometimes car interiors, uh, sometimes they're reupholstering furniture, and they're wanting to know that this particular machine that we're listing at the time will be able to stand up to the, a task as heavy duty as that. We picked the heaviest upholstery material we could possibly find. If you could feel this with your own fingers, uh, you could tell right away this stuff is designed to resist wear, which means it's also designed to stand up uh, to a piercing factor when it comes to a sewing machine. One or two layers of this would demonstrate the strength of that one amp motor in this Swedish machine. We're going to go through eight layers. We're starting with two layers right there. I'm going to go ahead and give it a fold. We're up to four. Now we're up to six. One more fold. We're all the way up to eight layers. Let me tell you one thing. If you have a, a, a newer machine at home, don't try this on that machine. Follow me down to the needle, and I'm also going to turn our light on because I see I haven't done that yet. There we go. All right, eight layers of very heavy duty upholstery material. Here we go. If you blinked, you missed it. And I even started out slow moving into that material. And you know what? On top of that, look at the quality of that stitch. Everything about that stitch, and I'm going to pull it way back for you so the camera can get a nice close shot of those stitches. The stitch integrity, the stitch spacing, it's just spot on. And as I rotate it around like this, Look at again the thickness of what eight layers of upholstery material looks like. You know what? That is ridiculously thick and it's probably likely that you'll never have to sew eight layers of upholstery material. But if you have to sew heavy duty, you know the reserve of power in this particular machine. And look at that lock-in stitch as well. It's just absolutely picture perfect. Everything that goes underneath the presser foot of this Viking 2000 it sews just beautifully. 